Welcome to Infra Software YouTube channel. In this video, we are going to show you how to enable the multi-factor authentication for users in Office 365. For this, open up the web browser and go over to admin.microsoft.com. After that, log in using your business account. Now after the sign in, you will be brought to this admin center. Now from this admin center, you need to head over to users and then click on active users. Now this will include a list of all the active users that you have enabled on your account. Now from here, simply click on the multi-factor authentication button, which is going to open up this new tab with multi-factor authentication user settings. Now suppose that you want to enable multi-factor authentication for infra SOS, then in that case, simply check box the user and then click on the enable option right over here. After that, click on this option that says enable multi-factor auth. Now you've successfully enabled the multi-factor authentication. Now the next step is on the user's end to set up the multi-factor authentication. For this, simply head over to login.microsoftonline.com and then log in with your user account. Now you can see that right after the sign in, it says that a certain action is required. Now from here, simply click on the next option and then download the Microsoft Authenticator app on your mobile device. Now once you have installed the Microsoft Authenticator on your mobile device, simply click on the next option on the website. Now on your mobile device, open up the Microsoft Authenticator. After that, simply click on the option that says add account and then choose work or school account. After that, come back to the website, click on the next option and it is going to show you a QR code. So on the mobile apps, simply select the option that says scan a QR code and then scan the QR code shown on the website. Now once that is done, your account would have been successfully added to the Microsoft Authenticator. Now on the website, simply click on the next option and then it is going to show you a notification on your mobile device. So from the mobile device, simply press the approve button to approve this sign in. And just like that, you have successfully enabled your Microsoft Authenticator. Now that brings us to the end of this video. Now additionally, you should check out InfraSOS.com because with InfraSOS, you can run reports to check which users are enabled and disabled for multi-factor authentication. Now the link for InfraSOS is in the description box. Other than that, if you want to learn more information about Office 365 multi-factor authentication, then simply check out the blog that is linked in the description box. And if this video has helped you in any way, then make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel.